Hello, Pastor Steve Waldron here today. George Santayana said, those that don't know history are doomed to repeat history. That's kind of paraphrasing what he said. Not knowing history, you're doomed to repeat it. Why is that? Well, our human nature has remained the same ever since the fall, the expulsion from the Garden of Eden until now. There may be different delivery systems Satan has, but basic human nature, as Jesus said, you know, he went through 13 natures of the heart. One more nature was presented in Matthew, so what is that, 14 natures of the heart kind of thing. Out of the heart proceeds these different things. When you study history, you realize mankind is on a, like a carousel. What has been is that which shall be, as Solomon said in the book of Ecclesiastes. Now, millennials, social justice warriors, those type things, they really need to get a grasp on history. When you begin talking about socialism, communism, um, if you would just look at what Mao Zedong, um, Lenin, Stalin, Pol Pot, these communist regimes did, what's going on in Venezuela. So it, it's very easy for us today, especially among younger people, to be divorced from history, to say history didn't have the internet, history didn't have Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, they didn't have the incredible lifelike video games, they didn't have virtual reality, they didn't have robotic technology, on and on and so forth. So. We are the generation, we are progressives, we know everything, and all knowledge belongs to us. But I'm going to tell you, there's a continuity of human nature that people have always been the same. Sodom was destroyed 4,000 years ago for some of the same immorality and sins that are going on right now. So they're not unique to our generation. They are in the heart and life of every person that has ever lived. So we're living in a time of fulfilled prophecy and it would do you good to learn the lessons of history. Be just, be moral, be brave, have integrity, learn how to endure hardship, learn how to you know, take offenses against you and let them be like water off a duck's back, so to speak. Learn history because I'm going to tell you if you don't, you're doomed to repeat it because we're headed down a destructive path. Everyone who goes, there's a way that seemeth right unto a man, the end thereof are the ways of death. Those that go down this pathway always end up in horrible consequences. So we need to have the pathway of the just that shines more and more, you know, brighter and brighter until the coming of the Lord Jesus Christ. We need to follow God, we need to follow His Word. There's blessings, there's prosperity, there's love, there's a peaceful society, there's unity among people at that moment. And so, no, we're not in the millennium, we're not in Eden, so there's always going to be fault. But you can't pick out faults to create bigger faults. And so many people think they can reinvent the wheel. Now, we understand technological progression. But you cannot reinvent human nature. Human nature is going to go towards greed. It's going to be, go towards power. As Nietzsche said, it's going to go for that will to power. And uh, evil people are going to seduce you. And they are going to manipulate you. And they are going to, to do horrible things to you. The communist revolutions have always promised the masses things. And once they're instituted, terror the same people they wanted to defend now become the enemies of the state and it's destroyed. And the people are destroyed. So learn the lessons of history. Things that are away from God don't end well. Seek the Lord that you may live. Seek the Lord where he may be found. There's still hope for America. Bow your knee to Jesus Christ. So millennials, SJWs, these type things, there are absolutes in the world. And I know you feel like you can reinvent everything. Um, have some humility about you. And look at the lessons of history. And understand that uh, God is still ruler over the nations. Be blessed today in Jesus' name.